<laughs> Welcome to Dude RV. Get away from the noisy car to go by. Welcome to Dude RV. Hey, I really appreciate you stopping by. And of course, you got here just in time. That's right, just in time for another campground virtual tour. I'm shooting with the Insta 360 as well as the GoPro Hero 9. Now, if you're on the, on the Insta 360 video, if you're on your cell phone, you can hit pause and turn your cell phone. Like you, you can do this right here. Take your cell phone and you can look all around and find that perfect campsite just for you. So I am at Fayette uh, Lake Fayette. Fayette Lake, wherever you wherever you decide to put your lake. I'm there at Fayette. Fayette Lake. And we are at the Oak Thicket Recreation Area. It's operated by RRM, but this is a Lower Colorado River, Blanco River Authority proper. It's a power plant lake. So let me get my camera set and we'll go see some stuff. Somebody cue up some good music. We need some tunes. This gate is like really tight coming in, just so you know. There's a trail that takes you to the other campground. It's three miles by trail or three miles by pavement. Either way, she said it's three miles to the other property. really impressed with this little campground and I don't typically do privately operated campgrounds but since this one is a hybrid it falls into that river authority playlist that I've set up so slide right on by this freedom trail freedom express Coachman. This is not going to be a very long video, just so you know. It's not a huge park. First thing we're going to do is take a look at the boat ramp from a boat ramp fan. And we actually have water at the end of this boat ramp. shelters with bunks for four and a ceiling fan to have power, water, bunks for four. We're going to go do the cabin loop and then we'll come back to the RV. Breaking the law, breaking the law. 
cabins are very, very cool for cabins. Actually, all have dishes, air conditioners. I'm sure, they have heaters. They, the deck faces the water. I don't know what they cost per night. They got, they got quite a few of them on this, on this side. Now, I don't know about the other. Have, haven't been to the other side yet. All right, let's go take a look at the camping loop. I find interesting is they don't really have any primitive sites here. So if you want to come out and pitch a tent, I, I don't see a place for that unless you rent an RV site. close to the end of October. We're in the third week of October. We had our first real cold front blow in this morning. North wind is a bit chilly. pull throughs here there are no full connections here they do offer a, a pump out service so if you don't want to go to the dump station you can pay twenty dollars and a truck will come by and pump out your tanks there is a fishing dock just for the camping loop right there it's not very deep water though you didn't get to see that so I better better turn it I tell you what I'm gonna I'm gonna make the loop twice so you can see it from both directions That's the end of the loop. The, the bathrooms are really clean, but the partitions are short. They come up to my shoulders. They're actually lower than my shoulders. So here's your dump station. They come up. It comes up to my chest would be a better way to say it. Not much in the way of privacy unless there's just a lot of short people coming in there. I don't mean that in a derogatory way. Yappy can't see over the partitions, but I can. So Fayette Lake is a power plant lake. So you'll find tilapia, there's probably some red drum. Once more onto the breach. Actually, we're 
I'm not gonna go slow. I'm gonna go fast. And we're gonna slip in here. Zippity doo da. Zippity doo da. Zippity day. My oh my, what a wonderful day. I have water at my sight. Hold on. Change my head gear. There we go. Hey, check that out. Isn't that beautiful? I sure, I sure appreciate you coming along for the ride. If you found some benefit, please click on that thumbs up and share me on your social media. That really helps with the YouTube algorithm. And for those of you, wait a minute. If you have not already, I'd be most honored if you'd consider clicking on the subscribe button. And for those of you that have subscribed and have been following along, <laughs> thank you. That's why I get to see that. I would, I would never have known about this campground if it wasn't for y'all. Thank you for that. Thank you very much. And for my patrons, I'm most grateful for your generosity. You guys rock. All right, y'all come back now, you hear?